nani nilikuwa nimesave uh, an amount of 20000 so ikaisha nikaanza kuona tena nitakuja drop shida for for the second time but before i drop for the second time ndio god god akatuma watu tu kama nyinyi unaona hivyo mmekuja mkiwa very well branded <coughs> wakakuja tu hivyo walikuwa wametoka back east bank of kenya wakafanya csr yao kwa shule yetu and then after doing the csr they interacted you see the way you are interacting with these kids yes. they interacted and felt that this kids really need uh, some support wakasikia tuko wengi wenye tuko bright na tuko needy so wakaambia the principal would like to support a few that are within the bracket of grade A and grade B thank god wenye niliingia shule juu ya hiyo dhasti ya kusoma nilikuwa within hiyo grade ya A and B so nika fit kwa the criteria wenye nilifit kwa criteria wakasema watatulipia school fees so they came back to cut the long story short they came back and when they came back wali to sponsor that student in the whole school only that year of us but what moved me and what bad to what we are seeing today in the slum is what that group did wakati walikuja nikaambua mimi ndio nitapeana vote of thanks nilikuwa kadogo nimevaa uniform so before ni peana vote of thanks one lady akakuwa invited aonge that lady anaitangwa Catherine Burugu akasimama akatwambia student msome kwa bidii kwa sababu hii pesa tumewalipia school fees nayo tumepewa loan na bank as a department alafu individually tutakuwa tunakatwa standing order every month we have a standing order for all of us so it is our personal money we are using to pay your school fees so msome kwa bidii and everybody clapped 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 na wakashangilia sana but as people are, were clapping me I was crying nilikuwa nalia yani nililia nililia nikasema you mean you mean somebody who does not know me can be removing money from their pocket to pay my school fees na venye nimetafuta sponsor for the seven years so that was like a big big miracle for me fast forward yeah. nikaambia god that time when god gave me the breakthrough ya kupata that scholarship nikaambia god now god i'm saying only two prayers prayer number one, help me to pass my kcse this let down our watu and for sure god alinisaidia nikapita kcse nikapata grade b na nika join university of nairobi praise god yeah. the second prayer that i prayed to god niliambia god the bible inatuambia you should not vow you should not make a vow and break it lakini nikaambia god me i'm intentionally making a vow to you god because you've come through for me in a big way umenipa the biggest miracle i've ever wanted ya kusoma if you bless me with a good job nitaenda nitafute watoto sijui yani nilisema if somebody who does not know my second name paid my school fees i will help children hata ukiniuliza huyu anaitwa nani sijui I want to help somebody that I don't know their names or I don't know their second name. So that is how Blessed to Transform started. Na nika nikamaliza nika graduate university, nikaenda nikafundisha ule mnaona pale anaitwa Dr. Nandoya. He is my lecturer, alinifundisha monitoring and evaluation. Uko Kenya Institute of Management Kim. He is my teacher, that is the wife. Huyu anaitwa Mama Joy. They are my good friend, wanaishi wakiniletea chakula, wakiniletea kuni and i'm happy they came and met you today so banya nilimaliza kusoma nika nikapata job and immediately and nilipata job in the year 2016 immediately before hata nikule salary ya kwanza because i got my job in the month of february nikaambia god i need to fulfill my vow to you and my vow to you i'm going to build a thanksgiving altar for me to mali nitakuwa naenda nikifanya kitu na ina kwa hiyo kitu nimefanya nikaya kukuambia thank you So nikakuja kwa Islam hapa na tukaanza activities. Tukachukua watoto kumi, watoto five girls, five boys, wakaenda wakafika 15, 20, 23. the year 2020, 2021 tulipeleka watoto 47 in the in high school. So now we are back with another lot because like now things are not okay. We are we have a lot of another 25 wenye tuna support. But then we have a, this feeding program that runs every day. And every day we kuna watoto wengi sana mtapata the other side we are feeding 500 kids sometimes they even more and uh, I want to welcome you here knowing that you are coming to an altar of thanksgiving I don't just do this I'm doing it it's very close to my heart because this is the only way to tell God thank you for what he has ever done for me so when you are, when you stepped to blessed to transform mumekuja to the altar of thanksgiving 
and I know hata nyinyi mmekuja kuambia Mungu thanks cause you've had enough mko na yenyu na Mungu amewape overflow ya kukuja kushia na hawa watoto so may god bless you feel at home atunanga complication these kids that you see here wanatakanga tu kupendwa like I've seen some of you lift them up it means so much for, for them it means so much some of them wanataka just a hug some of them they just need somebody to tell them i love you you know that's all they need and i know before you go back you're gonna have an amazing amazing time so i want us to make one big team to konai team inaitwa kanyoni team kanyoni is a big team wametoka all the way from kikuyu and kanyoni means a bird so yes. nimeambiwa ati ni bird kwa sababu a bird can fly everywhere and take good good tidings wherever they go so that's why we fly wakakuja mpaka korogocho leo si tuwapigie makofi thank you so much and then now we have the team from Sitam Kariobangi South Bible Study walikuwa wakuje wengi wengine watatu join baadaye and we are so happy to to have you because you are here representing the church si ndio tuwapigie pia wao makofi so from here we are going to go to where we do our cooking it's the other side Watoto wenye tuko tucheze kati nao wamerudi class so tutangojea watatoka class and then we shall continue with the game si ndio so si tupeleke wageni huko kitchen si ndio haya karibuni sana let's go to the kitchen hii huyu nani ni record kama ni nini eh well and god the holy spirit we receive this great blessing with a great heart and we speak an overflow we speak abundance Amen. we speak prosperity Amen. in the name of jesus Amen. and we pray that as, as according to proverbs 11:25 that he who refreshes others will be refreshed the god refreshes amen amen let's clap for them see you see you If you give a little more than you take And if you try to fix more than you break If you're the kind who takes the time to help a stranger in the rain is a place for people like you if you stand up for those down on their knees and lend a voice to those who cannot speak if you shine a little light give sight to the ones who've lost their way there's a place for people like you I've heard of there the streets are made of gold And when you get there there's a hand to hold I believe when your days down here are through there's a place up there for people like you If you walk around with your heart on your sleeve And if you try to be the change you want to see If you lay down your life for love so someone could be saved There's a place for people like you streets are made of gold and when you get there there's a hand to hold i believe when your days down here are through there's a place out there for people like you